Now, ahead of her arrival in Kenya, President Park Geun-hye expressed hopes for mutual prosperity with the East African nation. She pointed out how Korea's development experience and Kenya's potential could make good relations beneficial to both sides. Oh Jong-hee reports. Adding new chapters of success story through a shared vision of mutual prosperity. That's what President Park Geun-hye emphasized in an op-ed she contributed to Kenya's Daily Nation newspaper on Monday. Kenya is President Park's third and final stop in Africa, and before arriving there, she made sure to send her congratulations on Madaraka Day, which marks Kenya's return to self-rule in 1963. In her piece, the president said that Koreans can relate to the emotions Kenyans hold as both have endured colonial rule. Also, she said that the two countries are similar in that they are known for diligence and zeal for education and have embraced the market economy. She emphasized that these common features are a good foundation for friendly and cooperative relations. President Park also promised that Korea will become a reliable partner for Kenya's development and that harmonizing their respective experiences and potential would lead to a mutually beneficial partnership. She said that Kenya will be able to make an astonishing leap forward if Korea's development experience and know-how, internationally recognized as the miracle of Han River, are aptly shared. Pointing out that Kenyan exports have increased more than sixfold to become Korea's largest trading partner in East Africa, President Park said she hoped Korea's creative economy initiatives could also help boost Kenya's economic development moving forward. Oh Jung-hee, Arirang News.